What's up guys, Nepenthes here and welcome back to another FIFA 22 video. Let me just refocus myself. There we go. Welcome back guys. It is Sunday. It is 6pm or it's the 6pm content anyway and we're going to see what EA have given us today. Ooh, Silver Stars, Malquit. Um, That's win five in squad battles. Um, assist with three balls and score two with using midfielder in three separate squad battles games for the Silver Stars Man Queen. Another French right back. However, a Syria right back. And he's just not bad at all, is he? And again, guys, if you're enjoying the content, drop a thumbs up. Me personally, I really like the Silver Stars series setup EA have supplied us with. Um, that's a good card for a silver right back. You, you whack either an anchor or a shadow on him. Maybe he's a little low on stamina, but otherwise passing is nice for a fullback. Dribbling is really well-rounded for a fullback, it, like even a top-tier fullback, really. Um, physical's okay. The stamina, as I say, is a little low, and defending's okay. And so, yeah, I think Malkuit there, not bad. And then we should have another one. Ooh. Oh. 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 Five-star, five-star Cherky from Leon. High-low work rates. Flare trait and outside the foot shot trait. Low stamina again. Physical is otherwise quite nice. Dribbling's okay there. Passing's quite nice. Shooting is good. Pace is very good for a silver card. Ooh, he also links to that Paul Pogba. And there's a lot of French League silvers. And uh, he's just silver lounge, man. Oh, I mean, guys, that is... That is some card. I'll tell you what, that is that's super nice. Uh, nothing in milestones. Would be cool if they did an event, wouldn't it, for the Silver Stars? That That's cool, man. And then, oh, it's another French French League player. See, oh, my God, he looks good. He looks good. Let's have a look. Nothing in upgrades. Have we got Pims today? Oh. Marcel Desailly. Not a Pim. Lothar Mateus, not a PIM. This Desai is a good card, isn't it? Great defending and physical. Passing is a bit meh. Seven segments, the bronze and silver. 83, 84, 85, 86, 87. And then look, Lothar Mateus. Now, this is some card. His dribbling is a bit heavy. Three star skill moves, four star weak foot. Um, good physical is very good. Great defending. Dribbling is a bit heavy. Passing is good. Shooting is good. Pace is good. As a DM, he'd be good. Is there anything else here? No. Do we get Pims today? That's the question, isn't it? Um, <clears throat> nothing else there. Nothing for swaps. Then for the lives, it's going to be... Oh, is it just Cyprian? That's still there. So it's just Cyprian. Four-star skill moves, three-star weak foot. That's a cool card, man. That is a cool card. I, I All I need from EA from this point onwards is to give us more reasons to play with silver cards going forwards. Whether that be extra player picks in foot champs. Whether that be the silver... What's it called? That silver thing for the wins. Just repeated every time it finishes. Give us some reasons to go into games with these cards because, man, they're cool. And this Cyprien is cool. Four-star skill moves. Pace is nice. Shooting's nice. Passing's nice. Dribbling's nice. Defending's nice. Physical's nice. They're so well-rounded. So well-rounded. What else do we have? Mid-icon player pick. It's already there, right? I think that was already there anyway. Marky matchups. Marky matchups. Ooh. Prime icon upgrade. Was that already there? No, that wasn't. Prime icon upgrade. Three segments. 84, 86, 87. I don't know if I have enough to build this on this uh, this account right here. Let's have a look. Oh, I do. Oh, I d -d 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 do. Not really. Maybe I do. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We're good. We are good to go. All right. I need an inform. 
I'm going to build this uh, this pack right here, guys. We're going to open this Primark pack straight away. 84 for an 87. 84 for an 89. We'll just keep moving it down until we hit the, uh, the, the low threshold. 85 for an 86. Nope, there we go. That is the low threshold. Um, let's just pop the French. Nope, let's just pop the Premier League players like that. That's the first one done for a Prime Mix players pack. So, uh, yeah, the new content today, the Primark on upgrade... Marcel Desailly and Lothar Mateus, the Cyprien SBC that I think is very good. I do think is very good. And uh, yeah, outside of that, let me just grab footbin up real here. We're going to go and have a look at the in-game stats and the, and the chem styles and stuff of the um, right, an 86 of the uh, silver styles as well in just a second. 86 rated shouldn't be a problem as well. I've got, again, I had a, a whole bunch of like high rated golds. Yeah, Casemiro, Raheem Sterling. And then I had loads of 85s, right? And 86s as well. So we, again, should just be able to really comfortably uh, work this through. Yeah, I, I don't like, for, for me, you know what's interesting? Now, I know the PIMs are coming, right? And I don't know when. I thought they were going to be coming today. But I know they are on their way. Um, when they come, I'm excited for it because. They've been given big stat upgrades. <clears throat> and the reason why that's important is because even looking at uh, Mateus and Desai, now don't get me wrong and, and don't misinterpret for, you know, for, for all accounts. They are good cards. But, but they are not quite along the power curve. And that's why I'm looking forward, as I say, to the other cards that are coming. Because I think they are ahead of the power curve or at least in line with the power curve. Oh, this is this is going swimmingly here. Holy smokes. All right, that's a chemistry. There we go. I'll just pop that in. Boom. Um, yeah, they're basically, you know, no, like that Marcel Dessé, as I say, he, he's nice. But there are so many centre-backs out there that are better than him, especially given the fact his dribbling and passing is quite poor, but his pace defending physical is real nice. Um, then we look at Lothar Mateus, and again, you know, the three-star, four-star, that really heavy dribbling, um, that's kind of where you look at it and you think to yourself, they're not really it. Do you know what I mean? They're just not really it. And so when the PIMs come out, the fact that they've had these massive stat boosts is really intriguing to me. And for, for some accounts as well, for, so what I've seen is that they're, they're also getting weak foot and skill move upgrades. That's just so cool, in my opinion, man. Because they needed it desperately, you know. Um, right, we're actually going to be able to do this Prime Icon pack. Just real easy here. Uh, let's pop him there. Pop him in there. And boom, we've got ourselves a Prime Icon, boys. And uh, let me know in the comment section down below who you got in your Prime Icon pack. And, uh, yeah, it, 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 let's see if I can hit a bang at EA. Come on, just hook me up, baby. Don't hook me down. Hook me up with that Prime Icon. Hook me up with that Ronaldo, that 94 Ronaldo. You know. Oh, no, wait, hold on. That 96 Ronaldo. Yeah, yeah. Yes, please. Thank you very much. Hit me with a big one. Six flames. Yes! Oh... Just kidding. It's loud drop. It's loud drop. Who cares about him? That's tough. <laughs> ah, that's tough. Let's go on to footbin, guys. And have a little look. Again, these are, uh, you know, thumbs up for Mateus. Thumbs up for Desai. As I said, you know, as far as icons go, they're, they're some pretty good icons. Prime icon moments, universally thumbed up. And Cyprien as well, universally thumbed up. Um, let's just go and have a look at those three new silver players. Sadly, though, no sign of... Uh, ooh. Gakpo. Royale and Dasa. They're new, are they? They weren't there when we looked before, were they? Is that like mini-release? I think it must be, right? Now, Gakpo already has an 86 rated... Um, future stars, so it's 20k. Ibrahim Traore looks worse than some of these silver stars. Elidasa looks bad as well. So here is Cyprian, guys. He's been given 
a very, very tasty upgrade. Almost 300 in-game stats. This, I think this is a good card, man. As far as a DM goes, an anchor or a shadow is very nice. Do you know what? He might be a situation where a basic chem style is the one. Just give him a bit of a boost everywhere. 85 more stats, why not? Alternatively, you could go engine, get that passing up, get that pace up, get that dribbling up. It's it, four-star skill moves, though. It's, it's just... It's just a really, really, really nice card. Uh, we then got Malquit. Now, he's the SBC. Oh, I didn't even look at... I assume the SBC is just an 83 rated again. 20k. What's needed? Yeah, an 83 rated. So, bang on again. Um, we've got Malquit. Now, this is a good card. It's only 3 star, 3 star, yes. But with an anchor or a shadow. Yes, a shadow. That pace, that defending, good passing, good dribbling, decent physicals. That's a good card. And then this man right here, Cherky. He's been given 13 reactions, 25 stamina, and a massive upgrade outside of that. He's been given 5-star, five 5-star, five which he already had anyway. High-low work rates, which he already had anyway. This one's a bit of a difficult one. Depending on where you want to play him, you know, Maestro might be the answer if you're playing him from outside the box. If you're playing him as a striker, even a Hawk's not really that good. It doesn't give the shooting boost that you want. You might want to go finisher on him, you know. 99 dribbling, agility and balance top tier, shooting top tier, pace very good. Passing is decent. 5 star, 5 star, high low work rates. Give me some of that, man. I mean, that is absolutely fantastic. And this content in general, for me personally today, again... It's just absolutely fantastic and 90% upvoted. I like it a lot. And uh, again, you know, this is it's one of those ones where it's like, I just, I just really, really, really like to hope that EA will continue to give us reasons. that Because if they're just going to give us all of these silver cards during this kind of like off week and then nothing to do with them afterwards, it's going to be a bit boring, right? This here, which first of all, I just like anyway, but second of all, once this expires in four days and 23 hours, re-release it, but in milestones. Silver Gauntlet 2. Boom. Give some different rewards instead of pack rewards. Give more silver star players, more silver cards, like more packs that are a bit different. Just something a bit more, uh, you know, a bit more enjoyable. That is the content for today. That is the end of the video for today. If you enjoyed it, be sure to like, rate, and comment, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And for now, guys, I'm out. Peace.